bring time in Durango. We're right here at the intersection of College Drive and 550. What does that mean? What kind of issues do you deal with? Um, as far as issues go, uh, people can be tend to be a little bit impatient. Being able to go, stop into being able to go again, we're talking a couple minutes. Now I gotta wait like two hours or three hours there, the traffic. That's the bottleneck right there. And they're messing it all up. <laughs> The CIA project going on back there? This is a CDOT project. Oh, I thought it was CIA. Okay. Have you been nice to a flagger lately? Um, sometimes I wave to him <laughs> just to say hey. My feet hurt. I got a question for you. Have you ever tipped a flagger? No. <laughs> Has anybody ever approached you and asked you out on a date? Uh, not so much. I'm actually a very, very happily married man. Uh, that would be a lot nicer than people throwing things at us. <laughs> There's no place like home. <laughs> so when it comes to merging, people seem to uh, forget about common courtesy, and uh, they also forget how to read. A lot of times people are just trying to be super polite and get over early. But the way it works better is if everyone uses both lanes up to that merge point, and then everyone takes turns kind of like a zipper, right? You use it all the way up and then if everyone just takes turns, you can just see everyone weaving together and it works a lot smoother that way. Yeah! That is why I could never have this job. Mark Daly, FourCornersTV.com, in the neighborhood.